And now a statement from the Premier, the Honorable Makiva Bush. Hello Caymanians and other residents here in these islands. As we in the Caribbean collectively start to prepare for another hurricane season, we recognize that two things are essential. We must pray for the best, but also prepare for the worst. For those of us in the Cayman Islands, this wisdom has been cemented by our experiences with Hurricane Ivan in 2004, and again with Paloma four years later. Both storms were stark reminders that these islands are not immune to nature's wrath. However, they also illustrated the fact that preparedness does pay off. We are all aware that the hurricane season lasts from the 1st of June to the 30th of November, but we can also appreciate that these dates are only rough guidelines. This year, the atmosphere has already produced Tropical Storm Alberto. In matter of fact, the 2012 seasonal forecast predicts a less active than usual season due to the expected onset of El Nino conditions. Scientists project 10 neem storms, including four hurricanes, two of which they envisage as major storms registering category three or higher. Here in the Cayman Islands, we know that it only takes one to do some serious damage. We all remember the damage we had. So I call on you once again to take some time to prepare for a worst case scenario. We may or may not lie in the path of some of this year's storms, but we cannot afford to be complacent. We cannot foresee what is coming our way, but we can all be prepared and the groundwork for this readiness should start now. So go through the normal pre preparation list, from clearing your yard of debris and checking on shutters to putting a hurricane supply kit together. Use lessons learned from past storms and anticipate as well as you can. Then go a step further by checking on your neighbors. Lend a hand to help them complete the season preparations early and work on a plan for how your community will cope should we experience another devastating storm. As the saying goes, together we stand, divided we fall. Our strength lies in reaching out to each other, not just when things get rough, my dear friends, but even before. As we go into the coming hurricane season, we pray now for the loving mercy that only can come from the great architect who created this vast universe. It is God who keeps and protects us. He has done so all our lives and he will never, never leave us and promised never to forsake us. If we trust him, only then will we be able to weather any storm that comes our way. May the good Lord bless you and your family, our islands, and in fact, other islands in this coming hurricane season.